Hi all folks, this is a uh messed up there. Hi all folks, this is Max from HCCEvoHacks.com uh, and I've got the Viper ROM here. And uh, this one comes with um, a bunch of features and uh, basically the author of this uh, Viper ROM wanted to make a stable ROM with great battery life without compromising speed. Uh, anyway, it comes uh, with an overclock kernel, which isn't too much, but it, you can overclock to, it to 1.18 gigahertz. Let me show you that real quick. Um, so I got it at 1.188, so 1.2 gigahertz. Uh, the speed is comparable to other ROMs out there right now, um, but um, it does support um, it does support other kernels, um, so it does support custom kernel frequencies so you might be able to overclock it to two gigahertz i'm going to try it and if, if it works I'll, I'll put a video up uh, with the rc mix kernel later and uh other than that uh, let me show you some of the apps it comes with it co it comes with uh the sprint apps removed like blowware like adobe reader amazon mp3 blockbuster acc reader green hornet fm radio sprint radio sprint tv sprint nav 3d games um, if you don't need all of that stuff, this is great. Um, plus, all of that adds just a lot of overhead and just kind of drains your battery. Um, it comes with the latest Facebook, Twitter, Flashlight, uh, Equalizer, no, not, not Equalizer, um, Google Maps, Gmail, uh, Google Talk with video. Uh, it's based on Android 2.3.3. And uh, let me show you HC Sense 3.0. Um, so as you can see there, and uh, it's very comparable to other ROMs right now, like the MIG G3D. Um, this one also comes with a hot, hacked hotspot app, um, which is only for 3G, but it also comes with the regular Wi-Fi app for uh, 4G tethering, so you don't have to separately install it. Um, titanium backup. Uh, it's a pretty nice ROM, I would say. Um, if you're looking to get a long battery life, um, you might want to install this because that's the goal of the uh, the developer who developed this. Um, anyway, go try it out. Uh, I'll have the lo download links below, and uh, let me know what you think. And uh, probably gets a little bit better life than the MIG G3D um, and the other ROM. And also, I have more ROMs coming. Uh, next one, I think it's going to be the Senseless ROM but without the Sense UI if you don't want it. Uh, anyway, subscribe, guys, and I'll have more ROM reviews to this ROM, ROM Aroma Week or something like that. All right, see y'all.